So what I want to do here is to help you understand how stress play out in terms of productivity, in terms of performance, in terms of decision making. This is how stress affects decision making. So first off, what you need to realize is that stress, especially when stress results from the demand placed upon you is higher than your capacity. When that is what is causing the stress, if you happen to be working in an organization or you are working with a boss who seem to pounce on the fact that they are piling a lot of things on you, almost every time they are making demands, do this, do that, do this, do that, do this, do that, and that keep piling up on you, the demand being placed on you it tends to be greater than your capacity to perform. Over time, stress in this area will begin to affect your confidence. And when it begins to affect your confidence, fear and anxiety will begin to show up because it begins to affect your mental health. It begins to affect how you reason, how you think, how you process things. And of course, once fear and anxiety steps in, your decision is most times affected. So it begins to affect your decision making. If you have found yourself that you are unable to take action, you are unable to make decisions, could it be that stress somehow has been placed or could it be that you are experiencing stress could it be that you are overstretching yourself maybe the demand you are giving of yourself maybe you are even placing under certain demands particularly i've seen people put themselves under rules and must shoulds would could and must that they say that i must do this i should get this i must uh, i could do this because somebody else did it and you place such rules upon yourself, such demands upon yourself, and that begins to affect your ability to perform. Ultimately, it begins to affect your confidence because, of course, the moment you start saying could, especially in the area of comparison, you begin to see other people doing better than you and you are saying that I could be doing better if I had not done this or I had not gone this way. And doing that, that begins to create fear and anxiety for you. And of course, when you want to make decisions, your decisions are impaired because there's no clear thinking. There's no clear head involved. So I want you to look at this right now. If there's any way you've been creating stress for yourself, or maybe if your decision is being affected, maybe your fear, maybe you are experiencing fear and anxiety, could it be that it started off with stress? All right?